sacrifices I've been balling ever since I'm so cringy Hi guys, it's me Jessica and welcome to another video on my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a makeup tutorial on this look right here. It's just kind of like a brown, neutral, gold, halo eye. I used a bunch of new makeup products that I ordered and I'm really excited with how this look turned out. So before we get into the tutorial, I just want to remind you if you're not already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You don't want to miss out on the content. And yeah, without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump right into the tutorial. Okay, so here I am. Sup? So I have some makeup on right now. I have mascara and I have my brows filled in. I just felt like wearing makeup to school today. I don't know. I never wear makeup to school, so today was a big day. I'm going to put my headband on so, you know, my hair doesn't get in my face while I'm putting on makeup. And now I look like a four-year-old. I feel like this headband is way too small for my head and it really stresses me out because it makes me feel like I have a giant on my side. So I want to start off with my eyes first i don't know how i'm gonna put on eyeshadow because i already have mascara on but let's just see what happens so come close okay so first i'm gonna prime my eyes with my mac soft ochre paint pot this stuff is amazing i love it okay so there's like a train passing by could you be any more rude i'm trying to film a video i'm blending this out with my finger i'm not good at singing but i sing a lot so Today I want to try to use one of my old favorites, this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. So I'm going to go ahead and set my eyelids with the shade White Chocolate. So I'm going to be taking the shade Milk Chocolate and I'm going to use this as my transition shade. And I'm going to mix a little bit of salted caramel in there too. Just going to apply this to my crease and just really diffusing the shadow. This is just the first layer. I'm just applying this pretty sloppily, sloppily. Shut up! Okay, so I'm gonna take the shade Semi Sweet. So I'm taking this shadow and I'm applying it to the outer third of my lid. And then with the excess shadow, I'm just going to bring that up to the crease just to deepen it up a little bit more. And I kind of want to do a halo eye today. So I'm gonna take another brush and I'm gonna take that shade again and I'm gonna apply this to the inner third. So as you can see, the middle part of the lid is left blank. We're gonna be adding some glitter there. I'm gonna be using this today. Bet you haven't seen this before. This is the Stila, what is this called? Stila Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow. That was a mouthful. So I got it in the shade Kitchen Karma. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of this to the middle of the eyelid. So I'm just gonna pop a little bit. I'm gonna blend it out because I don't want the glitter to be too harsh. Oh, that is so pretty. I'm going back into my chocolate bar palette and I'm gonna go back into the shade semi-sweet and I'm gonna blend where the glitter and the shadows meet and I'm just gonna try to diffuse it so there aren't any like harsh edges. But I'm gonna go ahead and apply some lashes now. Okay, so I'm back. I put on some lashes. I use these lashes. They're Ardell Wispies. I love these. They're drugstore lashes. Super affordable and I love them. So I think I want to add a little bit more glitter to the eyes. So I'm gonna be using this. This is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitter Liner. I have it in the shade Midnight Cowboy. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of this glitter to where I put that Stila shadow a while ago. This is the first time I'm using it, and wow, I really like this. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the face now. Okay, so first I'm gonna be taking this primer, and this is the Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer Primer. I have it in the travel size because it was cheaper, so. I'm just gonna apply this to my nose area because that's where I have the most texture. I'm also gonna put a little bit of this primer on my forehead area. I also want to try out this primer today. So this is from Pure Cosmetics. They sent me some PR and this came in there. So I want to try it out. It's the No Filter Blurring Photography Primer. I think this is similar to the Becca Backlight Priming Filter and I really, really love that. I finished my travel size so I really need to buy the full size soon. I'm thinking this will do the same thing so. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of this to my face. I feel like an Instagram model. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna take my hands. I'm just gonna rub that into my skin. Ooh, look at that glow. Ooh, it gives me that nice healthy glow. Mm. Yes, pure cosmetics come through. Now I'm gonna put on some foundation. This has been my go-to foundation lately. Every single time I've been wearing foundation, this is the foundation that I wear. This has been my holy grail for the past month and this is the Makeup Forever HD Foundation Stick. I have it in the shade Y365 and I love this. Okay, so I'm just gonna swipe a little bit of this on my face 
then I'm going to blend it in. So I'm just taking my booty blender and I'm just gonna dab this in. Okay, now I'm gonna be adding some concealer. So I'm gonna be using the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. I have it in the shade Light Medium Honey. Now I'm taking my booty blender again. I'm gonna blend this all out. Okay, so now I'm gonna be taking my Laura Mercier powder and I'm gonna go ahead and bake. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do some nose contouring. I'm gonna be taking my Benefit Hula Bronzer. I've been using the Benefit Hula Bronzer for a while now and I've been using the trial size and I finally splurged and I got the full size. So this is the full size, I'm so excited to use it. I love the Hula Bronzer. I feel like it just, I like the way it looks on my skin. So I'm gonna use this to contour my nose and I'm using this awesome brush. It's the Nose Perfector Luxie and JD Weighty brush. So I'm gonna go ahead and contour my nose. I'm really bad at this, so don't touch me. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and wipe off all the bakage. Okay, now that I look like a ghost, I'm going to go ahead and bronze up my skin with some more Hoola Bronzer. Before I finish up the face, I'm going to finish up the eyes. So I'm dipping back to my chocolate bar palette. So I'm going to be taking a mix of milk chocolate and salted caramel and just putting that all over my lower lash line. Then I'm just taking a little bit of semi-sweet. Then I'm just placing that on the outer part of my lower lash line. So now I'm taking my Marc Jacobs eyeliner and I have it in the shade Blacker. I'm just going to go ahead and tight line and put some on my waterline. So now I'm going to add a little bit of mascara to my lower lash line. I'm just using the Tarte Light Camera Lashes Mascara. This is one of my faves. I love this. Okay, now I'm going to... I'm gonna add a little bit of highlight and I'm gonna be using this. I love this so much. This is the Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops. I have it in the shade Moonlight. So I'm gonna add like a drop or two to my beauty blender. I'm gonna put some on my cheekbones. Oh my god, do you see this glow? Like, it is so unreal. Ugh. Okay, to set this powder highlight, I'm gonna be taking the Laura Geller Gilded Honey Highlight. I love this so much. And then I'm gonna put this on top of the custom enhancer drops and it just intensifies the highlight even more oh my gosh and to blend the bronzer in with my highlight I'm gonna be taking my all-time favorite NARS blush this is in the shade madly and I'm just going to put this on the apples of my cheeks and this should blend everything together I love blush I know many people don't even wear blush like I feel like if I do my makeup I cannot go out the door without my blush like I need my blush I'm actually gonna add a little bit of glitter to the lower lash line I just want to see how it'll look so I'm taking that heavy metal glitter liner from a while ago right in the middle I just feel like it gives a little extra pop and I really like it okay so I went ahead and sprayed my face with some MAC fix plus just to melt everything together so now it's time for the lips I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips with the MAC spice lip liner Now I'm going to be using the Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in the shade Celebrity Skin. I'm absolutely obsessed with the formula of this liquid lipstick, so shout out to Jeffree Star. Okay, so now I'm going to set my face with some Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Okay, let me take off the kitty cat ears so I don't look like I'm five years old. Okay, so this is a finished makeup look. It's just a gold brownie halo eye and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and comment down below any more video requests that you have for me. And if you're not already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you'll be notified every time that I upload. So I hope you have a wonderful day. I love you so, so, so much. Bye! Magnific ma 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 magnificent <laughs> Wait that means forever ever hold up never mind Oh and also it's like super super hot right now I don't know why I'm wearing a freaking hoodie but I live in hoodies so <laughs> just gotta deal with it you know I'm actually gonna add